Well, first of all, congratulations on this movie. We we knew it was going to be good, but <laughs> but I think at the premiere last night, people just didn't realize how good and how hard it would hit them. It's got to be nice to be able to finally unveil this to people, right? Oh, it's great, and to unveil it, you know, to a wider and wider American audience. I feel like this is a fundamental part of our American history, not just our civil rights history, our American history, and it's just great to start to tell people about it. Well, and you said uh, last night at, at the premiere, it's not about any of you guys, it's about their story, and, and how important was it to tell the story and tell it the, the right way? I mean, you know, there's a tremendous amount of responsibility when you're carrying this precious thing. You're carrying um, the, the representation of two real people people that have uh, family members, people that uh, you've seen in, in photographs and watched move around in, in archival footage and speak, you just want to get it right. You know, you, you just want to be as sincere as they were. You know, when, when you watch the documentary footage of these people, I think the one thing you can't deny is their sincerity. Uh, they, they weren't trying to push an agenda. They, they, they were really just trying to live their lives. And so we wanted to make a film that represented that and felt like that. Well, and decades and decades later, this is still such a relevant story, and it's interesting, right, that, 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 that it is still so relevant. This is still part of our conversation. It is interesting that it's still relevant. It's very sad that it's still relevant. Um, you know, on, on levels of sort of discussions of racial tension and people, uh, for, for whatever reasons, seeing people as other and different and placing value judgment on that and all the, the, the terrible things that could be born out of that. And the state of the, the, this country in terms of equality of, uh, on racial lines or on marriage equality lines. Um, you know, the film, films of 50 and, well, 60 years ago, 50 years ago, the, the Supreme Court decision, and yet, uh, you know, we're, we're no, further really developed in terms of our thinking and our... Um... How great is Jeff? I told him he's five for five. He's got Have five you already movies. seen him this morning? Oh, yes. How is he? <laughs> <He's> <laughs> I haven't great. seen them. He's still great. Um, I'd be quite happy if I only worked with Jeff Nichols for the rest of my f movie career. I w I've never been so confident in going into a job, and it was purely because I knew that Jeff had, had just, you know, nailed it in terms of the script and his approach. So, and that meant that I felt super mm, willing to take risks and really like meet that challenge and meet him. Well, we're gonna tell everybody to see it on the big screen. Please and congratulations do. Thank you. on everything. Oh, it's yeah. such a pleasure.